Peggy 12. What a nap. As far as I can tell, you two have lost everything. All the memories and experience you've ever accumulated. These gents here have business in the low seas. Who are they? The giants from the hills. Ah! <coughs> Who made all this smoke? A talking weird thing! Then what if it's a mirage? How incredibly rude. I am just as human as you. That wouldn't even be the tip of the iceberg. Oh no. Hey now. That is certainly no way for us to treat a lady. The whole catch about joining the Federation is that you're asked to become an architect. Me? I'm with Seed, a mercenary group in the League of S. We fight against the Federation. Good. That's more like it. So where does this prophecy factor in? When time begins its march anew, they shall return as visitors. Giants from the hills of a world not our own. Upon Grimoire, they will wreak two divergent futures. One that brings salvation, and the other ruin. An enigma to confound even the highest mind. The way you use mirages, only Luce Farna ever held such power over them. Huh? What's happening now? The keys. There are four. Earth, fire, water, and shadow, if I remember correctly. You are a fool to let a medium to champion a fire! This is it. Home base for the League of S. Balam Garden. It has to be destiny! <laughs> Who are you? Mon! Shriek now! <laughs> Holy mom bombs! <laughs> Lady Yuna! You leave her to me! Hey, wait <sighs> up! So, basically, we've put Grimoire and other worlds in terrible danger. Luce Farna. <laughs> If you wish to find her, you must brave the Crystal Tower. Then our mom's up there somewhere? Time for us has resumed its march. This place, I know I remember it. And you? You aren't going to waver? We have a prophecy to fulfill. <laughs> <laughs>